More time outdoors during the summer, some social media users are warning about the dangers of tick-borne illnesses. Now, Brendan Lewis looks into the claims that cases of a rare virus are increasing. You probably know Lyme disease is the most common tick-borne disease, but did you know there are more than 20 other infections that are transmitted by ticks? One of those infections is the potentially deadly Powassan virus, and an article posted in early July said there was a rise in cases causing some people on social media to worry about their pets and loved ones. So let's verify. Are cases of the Powassan virus increasing in the U.S.? Our sources are the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the Connecticut Department of Public Health, the Maine Center for Disease Control and Prevention, and Dr. Stephen Bach, president of the International Lyme and Associated Diseases Society. From 2011 to 2015, the CDC reported 44 cases, and from 2016 through 2020, there were 134 cases, nearly triple the previous four years. Nearly all of the cases were in the Northeast and Great Lakes region of the U.S. So, yes, cases of the Powassan virus are increasing in the U.S. Health officials say not everyone will experience symptoms, but for others, Powassan can cause headaches, vomiting, and weakness. This can eventually lead to a serious disease that requires hospitalization, can cause long-term health problems, and is fatal for one in 10 people who get it. Health officials in Maine and Connecticut have each reported a death from the virus this year. Still, Bach says there's little reason to be overly concerned about the virus. I wouldn't say they should be worried. People should just know about it, but it's much less, obviously, much, much less common than, than Lyme. The CDC recommends treating your clothing and gear with repellent before spending time in areas with ticks and, once home, inspecting your clothing and body for ticks and then showering soon after. With your Verify, I'm Brandon Lewis.